<laughs> Look at that, I'm all wrapped up. Good evening. <clears throat> I was listening um, uh, to an article on the internet about the second uh, man that got shot in Farrison, uh, Missouri, San Louis. Um, and there's another single parent. I don't understand how it really, like, it justifies the police, you know, like, trying to state, oh, you know, this kid was a bad kid, you know, oh, he, we found a gun, so we shot him, you know, so, you know, to protect and serve, if your only solution is that you think you're at war with the American citizens, and you got to shoot them, and throw uh, pressure grenades, and smoke bombs, and go down the street with giant tanks, you know what I mean, um, it's going to be real confusing if, like, we had a, if you have a terrorist attack or something in St. Louis, they will they'll, they'll be running up, they'll be running to Ferrison to blow them up and probably passing out sandwiches to uh, people blowing up like uh, uh, the arch or something. <laughs> you know? Oh, well, they they look white, don't they? <laughs> Some shit I don't know. But it, I think we really have a security problem. I think that as long as that you know St. Louis has been really been segregated. Uh, 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 um, you know, and in a lot of ways, I think that they understood that the white, you know, uh, people that um, immigrated here um, after wars and, and that are now so, um, you know, uh, against um, the people uh, of color that's here, you know, um, I think their biggest problem is that they don't want us to know how inferior they are. Uh, emotionally, mentally, and and unable to, uh, uh, to comprehend, uh, you know, that um, they're supposed to be part of America. I don't know what their policing situation is. I know that that police is, uh, 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 that police chief comes off as a real disrespectful son of a bitch. You know, I can't imagine that he was birthed out of vagina. I think he came out of the butt. You know, I think he was a breech baby. You know, covered with feces. And ever since then, he just been making a big stench of the world. Uh, you know, when you, you know, I mean, he just, he just, his, his whole idea is just stink. So, but you know, I, I mean, I think that that our biggest um, uh, security uh, uh, problem is, is some policing thinking like that. You know what I mean? And if there is, if we do have a problem uh, with our black youth, you know what I'm saying? You shooting them um, up there at. at uh, in Ferrison, uh, Missouri, you know, um, is not the solution. The solution is that we're pumping out inferior students from our schools. They're coming out of high school and they're, and they're not even prepared to go to work. I remember when I was in school, you know, um, in, at 10th Avenue where they had signs that said no Irish, where they, where they started that type of thinking of policemen where, you know, you're so in inferior thinking because you you know they had no Irish you know no Irish welcome so they were like you know they could be B cops you know what I'm saying and you know they were getting paid very poor so here you are you seem like well, who you think is, is inferior and you, you know you take away all their goods and oppress them and uh, and, and uh, people colored black people still make it look good you know what I'm saying we still make it look good we're what makes this country great and this is why the country right now is in the pickle it is yes, the, the, yes there are people that are living very nicely you know, they're, you know, CEOs that work at, uh, 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 in the media, um, you know, the GOPs, the Republicans, you know, rather, uh, uh, um, with their super PACs are able to spend $40 million just to suppress, you know, the vote. You know, and, and in a sense, you know, we don't even really care. You know, we don't really even care. I don't care if that Darren Wilson falls off the center. The only thing I care about if the punk thinks he's going to show up and he uh, uh, up in up in up in up in my neighborhood. You know what I'm saying? I'll be on alert because I think he's dangerous. And you can have all the people you want, but it isn't. You know what I'm saying? It's not going to make you not have killed. Period. You have killed. Unless you can figure out a way to unkill, that I, that, uh, 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 or find out a way to empathize 
with somebody else's pay, somebody else's fight. You know, those 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 wanna be racist ass white police are 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 mutating to something unhuman. And I, I do blame our school system, I blame our government for allowing those type of uh, uh, people into the country that are no good. You know, something happened in 72, a lot of people know, I know like in my neighborhood in Hell's Kitchen, they had a whole bunch of them, they just coming in from Alaska, straight down through Canada, coming in, you know what I'm saying, next thing you know, the Bronx are trying to burn up, so, you know, they burn up the Bronx a little bit, try to move in a few uh, 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 new white people, you know what I'm saying, hey, you know, what are, you gonna, what are they going to end up doing, so, like they know, they know how materialistic, and sexualize the black community is so they're just gonna dangle you a few little dollars dangle you you know little twerkers get all your you know make you work all week long then go to the men go to the tea bar and spend all that week learning all money in one day you know what I'm saying uh, but like what well, well, still the what you know what I mean that that's you know I mean that's like the whole philosophy let's keep these black people busy spending money here comes Thanksgiving you know make sure y'all stay busy y'all got to run out right after Thanksgiving dinner and go Christmas shopping and spend all your money and get in debt so you don't have a way out you know you're we we caught up in the propaganda but you know I think the best person that ever proven that the black people are superior was during World War II with Hitler when they had the Olympics. So now they're over here trying to destroy the black community, you know, uh, by, uh, by the education system being flawed, by their food being flawed. There's no reason for us to have an epidemic of diabetes. There's no reason that we have an epidemic uh, 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 of socially retarded ass policemen that can't comprehend that their job is not to destroy America but to to protect and serve. You know, unless we start changing our politics, unless we stop having politicians that are selling uh, America out for a few little measly dollars for you know what I'm saying uh, that new guy that um, looks like a turtle that took the secretary place with the Viennese looking wife you know he's all he's always talking about immigration immigration where the fuck did your family come from because they didn't come they didn't come from this continent of this America you know what I'm saying they came from Europe you know what I'm saying? If you have a problem with immigration and you're white in America, immigrate your ass back to where the fuck you came from. You know, and then it's settled. You won't have to be worried. You know what I'm saying? If you're a policeman and you're in Florissant, uh, Missouri, you know, a suburb of St. Louis, St. Louis is very segregated, a very dirty, nasty looking city. You know, where, uh, uh, um, you know, I got, uh, 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 the, uh, the only thing they got going for them there is Boeing. And Boeing, Boeing ain't doing all that good in the marketplace from what I see. Yeah, they got planes falling out of the sky, God forbid. But anyway, for all, most, for all purposes, uh, um, uh, 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 the planes is... Anyway, even the plane situation, we, you know what I'm saying, like, they, I used to love going to Wichita, Kansas with, on the train, there's no, there's no train stop there, you know what I mean, you could, you could go, but, the tra you know what I'm saying, it's like, all they want you to do is fly, I don't want to fly, I don't want, I don't want to get uh, um, filled up in an airport, a uh, 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 fondo discomfort, uh, 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 pay all that money so I can feel uncomfortable, so I can feel like any moment they can just go ahead and Stop the play and do whatever they want because they got your money now. And you're a hostage and they got all these excuses. We're scared of terrorists and whatever. You know, uh, if, if I'm in the train and they want to go through with their dogs or whatever, at least I can walk around, go to food car. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? At least I can stretch. But, you know, uh, our country is moving backwards. And it's because of the politics like they have in Ferrisson, like they have in St. Louis, like they have in a lot of these southern states. You know what I'm saying? And, it's, you know, as long as our children are treated without uh, the rights, 
You know what I'm saying? They will they will grow up to become a, a, a policeman that think it's okay to shoot someone because they can think of a 958 fucking excuses. You know, oh, I was scared. Oh, well, he had a gun. You know what I'm saying? The same person yelling about this kid has a gun is the same one uh, marching with the NRA for gun rights. So you're a bunch of double-binding hypocrites. And that's the worst thing for a child is to have a double-binded hypocrite. You know, I bet you have, I bet those white policemen have a lot of children with AD and other uh, mental defects um, um, that they're raising now. And it's all because your thinking is not that of a person that could comprehend his actions. Your actions, right, is the result of the reason why it, Darren Wilson's actions is the reason why he shot that boy. It had nothing to do with Darren and, uh, and Michael Brown walking down the street, regardless if he was shoplifting. I like to find one person in their 50s that's never, ever at the same age, whatever age that policeman is, they didn't shoplift. I bet you he shoplift. I bet he's a dirty, stinking, thieving, murder rat. And we know he a murderer. So it doesn't matter if he gets let off. It doesn't matter because you know what? We just ain't gonna have no respect for the justice system like we don't have it now. Because it's not working to secure uh, the, the, uh, 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 the people. We don't have a justice system in Memphis that's working. All you think they're trying to do is pump money out. And the way they're pumping money out by using pump, they like to pump money out of the justice system. You know what I'm saying? Throw money at it. Get you a lawyer. Throw money at him. Go to court. Throw money at them. You know what I'm saying? Hell, you can throw money all the way. And and, 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 and and what are you going to do? House a one out of every four child that comes out of high school in the prison system? You know what I'm saying? You, know, what, you want America to look like Europe did before they started sending people over? What are you going to do? Send people to Mars? Wouldn't it have been a lot easier to have some scientists and just make another continent uh, in, uh, in, in the Pacific Ocean somewhere? Or wouldn't it be make better sense to have some engineering scientists that you know can figure out how not to pollute the air and, and the land so much? You know what I'm saying? I mean, like it's just like that one guy that shot those policemen up in Pennsylvania way. He thought he was going to live off the land. You cannot live off this land anymore because we have extinguished other life forms that we could have lived off of, that we could have used for food, we, you know, and when I say extinguish, I mean, they went and they just killing, you know, but I don't, you know, this is America where, okay, you know, white people, NRA power, gun power, we need all our guns, we're scared, but, you know, black people, you know what I'm saying, we're supposed to get our guns illegal, why? Why can't we go to uh, 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 why, why don't the police just pass out guns in the black neighborhood? You know what I'm saying? If you want to have a war, that's all you got to do. Maybe they ain't even want to shoot your ass. Maybe they fucking just, maybe we'll just go off to South America and you'll see how fast, how, 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 you know what I'm saying? But we ain't going anywhere. The only people that are going to be leaving is your white trash people because eventually your, your thinking and your ways. And second of all, this planet keeps uh, with the greenhouse effect. It just ain't gonna be any of you, cause you got, cause like you know what? If you think you think this is gonna be this whole world's gonna be white, it's not because that's why uh, the the sun turns us brown. You know what I'm saying? And black people are superior ways. And it don't matter how you destroy them up in your propaganda with your schools that are pumping out kids that can read, can write. You know, can't get can't get a job, but they get. But you know what I'm saying. By the time they, when the, by the time the men are 30 years old, you know what I'm saying. They're so they got so much STDs. I wonder what that. I think what they what y'all need to do with that that place of Ferguson is check those policemen and make sure they don't. Maybe they have some type of sexual parasite that's up in the frontal lobe or something. But anyway, we do need a new police department because if they go around killing people and their solution to after a, a, a policeman on their department kills someone is to go around and act like a bunch of racist double binding 
uh, murdering perverts that don't have no self-respect for a human life that whatsoever that you can't even the first day that chief should apologize you don't go around shooting people and then going around uh, uh, fire you keep shooting at people with your rubber bullets and your tear gas you think you know what I'm saying you know and it, you know and there's and you can't fool all of the people all the time you know so you know whatever you know saying if he believes in God well you know you, you gotta weep with your soul you gotta weep with your soul so you can be scared and run around oh I'm scared of black people why you white people run around with your bang bang game and your, your, your centuries of, uh, of your wars and, and, and you know what I'm saying so they, they, they you know you, you, you're trying to hurt the children right don't worry, we all go. We all went to work Monday, right? Get that paycheck to go spend money. Make sure we have our taxes to pay for these policemen to come up in our neighborhoods and shoot us. I bet you one day. I bet you he ain't gonna be rich. I bet you that. I bet you. That, I bet you not one of those little white trash ass motherfuckers that uh, that are policing Ferguson and then going over to their suburbs. I bet you not one of you. They're gonna be rich and they should get out of the policeman gang. And then, and then if you do got a policeman game, you have to be able to fucking think on your own two feet and not be using secondhand information, thinking like you don't know something and you're too ignorant to learn. Is that hey? You know what? I'd rather be stupid because a ignorant motherfucker turns into an old ass, crippled-minded fool. <laughs>